At last check, the Thomas Dell freshman was being held on rape and abduction charges. His 15 year old alleged victim saying that he took her into a high school bathroom and raped her. Meanwhile, her mother saying that the school system needs to start supporting her daughter and being more transparent. This Chesterfield mom tries to hold back tears as she recalls. It's the hardest thing we've ever gone through. The February 25th day, she says her daughter was robbed of her innocence inside Thomas Dale High School. When I received a call from the assistant principal, she says she was informed by administrators of an incident involving her 15 year old in the girls bathroom. She'd arrived to find her daughter with a police officer inside the school. They were actually able to pull the video footage up of him pulling her first by one by one wrist and then by both wrists into the bathroom. He takes her into the largest bathroom stall where he fights with her to unbutton her pants. Um, and then once he got his, her pants Once he got her pants down, he like forced himself in her. Luckily, the bell rang, and she said he says "OS oh, word" and tells her not to tell anybody and runs out the bathroom. Investigators say the alleged victim was forced into the bathroom by a known 15 year old male where she was sexually assaulted. She was then taken to St. Mary's Hospital where she underwent a forensic examination and was treated for potential sexually transmitted diseases. They did like an exam of her vaginally. It looked like a lot of pictures. Um, it was pretty tough. What do you feel was taken from your daughter that day? Everything. Um, her innocence, um, her trust. She says she trusted him. I would even say the trust for the school was taken. Um, they still aren't reaching out um, like I feel as though they should. Um, they're unsympathetic. What would your message be to Chesterfield County Public Schools? My daughter is more than just see your reputation. <laughs> Seems like they don't care. We reach out to the Chesterfield County Public School System for comment. They said, quote, the school division has been in continuous contact with Chesterfield police throughout their investigation. These are very serious charges and the school division takes very seriously our responsibility to provide a safe and supportive learning environment. Students who violate student regulations are subject to suspension or expulsion and if the offense is a violation of the law to prosecution. We also asked why parents weren't immediately contacted after this February 25th incident. The school system did send us communication that was sent out at 1047 this morning.